Good evening and welcome to ITV News. This is Wednesday night's calendar. Thank you for joining us. Here are tonight's main story. Try and try again. I just go and get stuff and I get going. The rugby league player on his first England call-up at 76 years old. Come on. I'm still standing, the rugby league veteran with his first international call-up at the age of 76. And why Stuart Piper inspired sporting folklore. And it's uh, fantastic as he is, he's a relative newcomer compared to uh, someone you went to see last night. He really is, yeah. Do you know what, do you remember these? <laughs> so you get loads of them. Yeah, you get loads of them. The but this wasn't fan mail, it was sent to us a couple of weeks ago by a man called Stuart Piper. Now, Stuart is a former professional rugby league player. He spent all of his career at Doncaster playing 230 matches, but Doncaster was a very different team back then. There's no easy way of putting this. They were dreadful. And as such became the subject of a famous Yorkshire television documentary called Another Bloody Sunday. Well, I'm pleased to say Stuart is still playing at the ripe old age of 76 for the Doncaster Toll Bar Masters. And as Stuart told me in this letter, he's finally been recognized at international level. Come on, yes, come on, boys, come on. Age is no barrier for Stuart Piper. At 76, he assumed the chance to play rugby league for his country had passed him by. But in November, he'll fly out to Belfast to represent England Masters, a team for players aged 35 years and over. I got a call from the uh, England Masters uh, coach and he said, we'd like you to come along and we think you can do us a job. And I said, are you sure you've got the right person? <laughs> <laughs> it's me, you know, I'm, I'm 76 year old. I can't wait to get on that field in Ireland. You know, because I said it's going to be tough. And I like it a bit tough. And he's going to get stuff, and I get going. He does some tackling sometimes, you're not supposed to be tackling. We went to Blackpool uh, a couple of weeks ago, uh, a festival, and he got told off a couple of times because he's still, he's still there, he's still got it. Do you go easy on him? Um. If I go easy on him, he shows me up. <laughs> so, I have to do my best. Oh, now there's been a fair bit of excitement amongst the lads that our cameras are down here tonight, but this isn't the first time that Stuart has started on screen. In 1981, Yorkshire TV followed Doncaster Rugby League Club, then the worst team in the country. Have you ever gone an entire season without winning a match? Not yet. This is what we're worried about. And it was Stewart who gave the programme its title. You've got to win that Sunday. Another bloody Sunday. People still shouted to me, another bloody Sunday. And I played last week and uh, there were some supporters there shouting to me, you know, another bloody Sunday, well, this is another bloody Sunday, you know. Oh, you know, people never forget. I think that was a real momentous time in, um, in rugby league in this, in this town as well, you know, and I think if you speak to any rugby league fans across the country, really, you know, they'll all know about that documentary. How long are you going to keep playing for Stuart? Ooh, I don't know about that. Um, it, it takes you a week to get over a, a knock, uh, but motion is the lotion. That's right, I keep saving myself. <laughs> you suspect there'll be a few more bloody Sundays before the sun sets on Stuart's time playing rugby league. So there you have it, motion is the lotion. Motion is the lotion, that's show, my new catchphrase. Just goes to show, doesn't it? Send in letters. Yeah, yeah, yeah absolutely. We do. Letters, emails, you know, we love yeah, to hear your stories, talk. and that was a good yeah, one. Yeah. Doesn't he look good on it? He looks really good. Fantastic. I'm sure he'll smash it over an hour. I think he will. <laughs> <laughs> well, when we're done now, let's get the weather from Kerry.